Back in May, when the Old Man Cricket team visited the island and spent a day for the young players of the Barbados Royals Girls Cricket Club, who would have thought that months down the line, it will lead to a partnership that has seen the two entities send a memorandum of understanding. Chairman of the Royal Girls Club, Dr. Sasha Sutherland, shared the details of the MOU. The purpose really is to enhance the development and visibility of, of female cricket uh, in both locations and to facilitate exchanges between the club and the and Oman cricket. Uh, we also want to exchange ideas and knowledge about best practices in, in coaching, fitness and player development. And that may sound uh, perhaps as skew to um, the elitists, the cricket elites are among us, but just understanding that Oman has been able to do something fantastic with their facilities and their women's cricket development program. So even though they are newer to cricket than some of the established nations, I think the idea that both of us are in the embryonic stages of women's cricket development and, you know, they, they, the genesis of their program just really speaks to women's holistic development, making sure tournaments are organized, best practices in, in coaching. That's kind of the, the basis of the, the exchange. The Royal Girls Cricket Club has been in existence just under a year, but they've made significant ground in forging some other strategic partnerships. In the pipeline is one with the Red Foundation, headed by Patron and Cultural Ambassador, the Most Honorable Stetson Red Plastic Bag Wilcher who also has a special tie to the club as one of their advisory board members. We are in, in current talks with um, a number of entities in terms of partnering with them, among them the Sandals Foundation. Um, immediately, we are hoping to partner with the, the Right Honourable Stetson Wilshire and his, his foundation in the creation of a, an after-school or an after-club programme, which now looks to marry athletics and academics and so the idea behind that is we want fantastic athletes but we want athletes who are also capable of carrying a conversation being ambassadors for Barbados and the Caribbean being critical thinkers and being leaders um, of tomorrow so immediately we want to provide the support whether that is providing stationary school supplies, et cetera, for the girls as they go back to school and eventually providing academic instruction to them, helping with homework, et cetera. There is a hope that more entities will come on board as the club pushes its mandate of developing female cricket talent starting at the youth level, while working with the Barbados Cricket Association to re-establish a full women's cricket program on the island.